Hello YouTubers, beer geeks, and beer hounds alike. Bill here. We're going to do a beer review. Okay, this one's a collaboration. Um, it's a collaboration with Made West Brewing Co. and um, Pizza Port Brewing Company. And it's the short-lived series. And uh, number 17, I think. That's what it's saying. It says 17 on the little pier. Um, they're from Ventura, California. Pizza Port, I believe, is from, I think, Carlsbad. I'm not sure, 100%. Um, of course, I've never seen this before. Canned on 6-1-22, so it's seeking about a little over two weeks old. So it's super fresh. Got um, four pints of this at Whole Foods for like 14 bucks out the door. And that's what the can looks like. I'm assuming it's 17 because I've done some of the uh, short-lived series before. I don't know if it's 17 of them, so I don't know which one this is. Pizza Port, that's which one it is. So yeah, um, I do recall those the series being fairly good. I mean, didn't wasn't mind blowing or nothing, but decent. Okay, I like the way they do their date, nice and clear. Okay, that's how it should be done. So uh, let's handle it. Well, it's a Westy. Made West makes some decent beers. Um, this puppy comes in at seven percent alcohol by volume. Okay. Pizza port's pretty good too. So we have a Westie. <clears throat> okay. So we have a tight head, very tight, uh, creamy, frothy, silky. We have a nice clear amber color. Pretty much spot on amber, maybe just a, oops. Touch light. There we go. Good, okay. A light amber, I would say. Yeah. Pretty much amber, though. Nice and clear, West Coast style. Alright. Alright. Let's check out the aroma. Hmm. Nice. That's a nice one. Nice smelling. Getting some pine. Of course. Nice pine, some floralness. Maybe a little lemon zest, kind of like um, like you'd smell in like dish soap, but doesn't smell like soap, but like the lemon zest part. Yeah, it smells really nice. Really nice pine notes. Um, very, uh, very good smelling. I'm gonna try the foam. Last train home. Oh, that's nice. This is tasty. Yeah, the pine notes are coming through really good on the um, the froth. Oh yeah. Sneeze button. All right, made it in time. Cool.
Nice. Nice. Almost like um almost like hop oil, kind of a hop pine. Let's get it. Cheers. Kind of like that oil, hop oil uh, extract, extract. Kind of like that. Medium mouthfeel. Um, no booziness at all. Very nice. Yeah, the the liquid is pretty much on par with the uh, the froth. Yeah, it's not like blowing me away. Um, it's a real nice balance of uh, the malts are not really prevalent. It's more of like a, a hoppy, just kind of water almost. Um, beer but it's nice it tastes good pretty nice yeah so I'll sip on it for a while and let it warm up see if I can pinpoint some notes and I'll be right back I'm back. It's pretty good beer. A little pricey, I think, for actually what you're getting here, but you don't know until you try, right? So um, I'm gonna swill it one more time. We'll wrap it up and uh, see what we come up with here. Then nice, you know, really nice piney kind of nose and floralness, and uh, uh, kind of like a little lemon thing, maybe a little sage or something coming through. Fairly nice, a little grassiness or something in there also. Yeah, I mean, it's not blowing me away. It's not going to be super memorable. I mean, I, I probably will totally forget about this after I'm done with them. So, it is what it is, right? Just leaving some good lacing on the glass there. Cheers. Yeah. I mean, it's just another West Coast Westie. It's just another run-of-the-mill West Coast. Um... I think it's a little overpriced, personally. That's just my opinion. So, on a scale of one to five stars, I'm going to give this puppy like uh, four stars. Just, you know, it's a really good West Coast um, IPA. I don't think I'll, like, uh, pick it up again, but, you know, it is a good beer. It's a tasty beer, but uh, it's just not very memorable, and uh, the price is a little off, you know, for me. But uh, definitely a tasty West Coast style IPA here. So, uh, you know the deal. You have a great day. Cheers. Catch you later.